In this video, I'll answer the most common question I've received in this series, how much did it cost? I'll run through the rough pricing of the major components. For the hardware and consumables, I'll try to make good estimates. I'm sure I missed some things, so take the summary with a grain of salt. Also, this won't include new or replaced tools. That's just one of the bonuses of having a fun project. I got most of these items from the big box stores and major online retailers. I'll provide some links to the products in this video's description. To start off with, I got the trailer for about $7,700. The three windows were about $150 each. The total cost for insulation was $150. The ventilation fan was $140. The planks for the shiplap ceiling were $225. The added walls were around $100. The vinyl flooring was $300. Then the wall covering was $350 for the vinyl and glue. That rounds out the walls, floors, and ceilings with an additional $70 for miscellaneous consumables. The bathroom and water systems were a major cost of the camper. For the shower, the pan was $160. The shower head was $40. The plumbing, glue, sealant, and tape were around $100. Then the FRP board for the walls was around $50. The toilet was $150. The waste tanks were $150 for the black tank and $200 for the gray tank. Then it was about $70 more for the mounting hardware. The fresh water tank was $100. The pump was $70. Then there was another $200 in plumbing. Finally, the water heater was $270 with about $30 in venting materials. All those features added up to a pretty comfortable bathroom. The solar system was also a major cost of the camper. The 400 watt solar panels were $320. The batteries were $340. The MPP charge controller was $220. The inverter was $340. The miscellaneous electrical items like the fuse panel, switches, outlets, and wires were about $100. The table and bed system only has a few components. The foam bed was $200, and the material for the bed cover was around $50. The wood for the seats was $80. The tabletop and table hardware was around $150. The kitchen and cabinet area doesn't have many components either. The sink, faucet, and plumbing was around $200. The wood for the cabinets and counter was $200. The laminate was $50. The miscellaneous screws, hardware, and adhesives were around $150. Finally, the refrigerator was $250. That all adds up to around $14,000. Consumables like paint, paint supplies, sealants, glues, screws, and nails, plus the miscellaneous lumber, plumbing, and electrical bump that up to around $16,000. I think an overall cost of $16,000 is pretty good for a camper with all of these features. The experience and end result were well worth it. If you found this interesting or helpful, consider giving the video a like. I'll be posting more follow-ups and some more builds soon, so subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for watching.